What to expect from a home inspection when selling a property. You've done the work to get your home ready to sell. You've repainted rooms a neutral color um, and taken care of minor repairs. You've hired a great real estate agent myself. Um, it has been staged to perfection. You kept it clean for open houses and home tours. And now you've accepted an offer. Up next, the home inspection. I'm Kizzy, Certified Probate Real Estate Advisor, which means that my team and I specialize in helping executors, administrators, and trustees with homes in probate or a trust administration. This channel is intended to be an informative resource upon which you can rely to answer the questions like, what do I do now that my loved one has passed away? Um, what is the probate process? What do I have to do to get the process started? So back to the inspection. Once the buyer orders a home inspection, your home is in the hot seat. Even if you've gone through the house with a fine tooth comb and listed anything and everything on the seller's disclosure, the home inspection might reveal issues that you weren't aware of or are worse than you thought. It can be a stressful process for both sides as buyers and sellers await the results of and then negotiate repairs or other issues that were revealed during the inspection. To help ease your mind, we'll walk you through what a home inspection is, um, what to expect and how to be prepared when your house is under the microscope. Newsflash, no home is perfect, but you can take steps to be ready um, or to ready yourself and your home for the home inspection to minimize unwanted surprises. What's a home inspection anyway? Well, it is a visual inspection or a visual examination of a house's structure and systems by a trained inspector. The inspector usually looks at the foundation, the roof, the attic, walls, ceilings, windows, doors, in any attached decks or porches. He will also inspect the electrical, the heating, air conditioning, and plumbing systems. In the process of closing a home sale, the buyer typically hires a home inspector um, to come to the house and perform a visual observation to confirm the state of the home and identify any issues that poses a health safety issue um, that the buyer should be aware of before purchasing the home. A buyer's inspection occurs after you've accepted an offer, but before the closing of the sale. And so after a home inspection, the buyer may be able to re renegotiate their offer or request that repairs if certain issues come up or made. In some cases, the buyer may walk away from the home purchase if the home inspection reveals more issues than they are willing to deal with. Remember, because an, a home inspection is not a pass or fail test, it will open doors for renegotiation. Um, you're not obligated to fix anything as the seller. However, the buyer is also not obligated to buy your home. They may walk away if they are not satisfied. A typical home inspection takes a few hours for an average size house, um, and then the reports take about three to four days to complete. The home inspector will go through the interior and the exterior of the house to record any broken, defected, or hazardous issues. There are a number of major things that home inspections um, or home inspectors look for. Though this is not an exhaustive list, water damage, structural and foundation issues, old damaged roof, damaged electrical systems, plumbing problems, um, insect and pest infestations, issues with the HVAC system, garage door operation, step or stairway and rolling safety, 
fireplace operation. Um, if the inspection turns up major flaws like a pest or mold problem, then the inspector may recommend having another expert to come in to confirm their findings and to give recommendations. If you are planning to sell a home in probate, I do have a free Texas probate guide that I would love to send you um, and you may request it via email at kizzy.grant at exprealty.com and I will be happy to forward that right over to you. Again, as always, thank you so much for watching. If you found this video valuable and helpful, please like and subscribe to the channel and also click the notification bell so that you will be notified of new release videos and I'll see you in the next one.